It's a huge day. Oh my gosh. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. breakfast as you can tell it was really good um but we were just talking and we have these decorations up on our mantle for we did it for memorial day we put it up memorial day so it's been up for memorial day fourth of july and now the olympics and robert is like we just had it up for so long and I was like, well, do you want to make your birthday the day that we officially start decorating for fall every year? And he was like, new tradition. That sounds like so much fun. Yeah, that sounds like fun. Yeah. Because I'm so ready for fall. Fall is our season. Up here in the, I guess, the upstate or the tippy top of South Carolina, close to North Carolina, close to Tennessee, close to Georgia Mountains. Like, that's the greatest season that we have up here. Summertime, it's really not that much fun up here during summertime because you have to travel somewhere for summer. Like, you could go to the lake, but it's gonna be ice cold. Or you could go to the beach, but that's three hours away. Fall is where it's at. And Kaylin went to the craft store yesterday to Michael's and got a lot of fall crafts. I got a lot of different fall things. Um, I'm gonna make a wreath, which it's a wooden wreath, but it's outside because this one here likes to eat wood. So I'm keeping it outside so she does not eat it. But I'm putting this on it. And I'm putting this on it. And I'm gonna make a cute little sign. Oh, it's gonna be adorable. Okay, well, then. Here it is right here. Yeah, Same. that's the wreath. That's the wreath. I can actually do that now. Yeah. And then I'm making something out of this. What, you know what I, when I saw it, I was like, doesn't that look like a little pumpkin? Oh, it does. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's like a little pumpkin. <laughs> um, It's not supposed to be like that, but it has a little knot on the top. And then I have, I'll show you a little bit of this craft I'm doing. Yeah, yeah. All this fun paper. Okay, what else did I get? Oh, I got this, which I put up here so the dogs want to eat it too. It's a half pumpkin. But I'm gonna do something with that. And we got some new flowers for up here. Oh yeah, I got we got new flowers for our little vase thing. I think we might need to get some more. Actually, I think they would go better in this vase, which is shorter over here. We like to keep fake flowers up there because we just like flowers and it's Oh, it looks cute there. Yeah, that looks mm -hmm. good, right? That looks a lot cute. That looks a lot better. Yeah. That looks more fall. I can actually even... Oh, I can put vinyl on there. Oh, yeah. That says something. And I can... Because it comes off easy. Like, fall, y'all. Happy fall. Yeah. Can we switch from American USA to fall? <laughs> the Olympics is still going. The Olympics is still going. It's been going forever. Ugh. Fine. It's I think that's, she is the one who said that should be a new tradition. I know. Has All Michael right. Phelps done everything he's gonna do? Yeah, he's done. Okay, so Michael Phelps is done, <laughs> the Olympics is done. <laughs> Alright. I think one of the coolest things about this house is that we have a fireplace in our dining room. I just and it's wood burning fireplace. I just think it's the coolest thing. Mm -hmm. I love it. I want Kaylin to start doing her Foodie Fridays based off this woman. What do you think, Pioneer babe? Woman. I love Pioneer Woman. Her recipes are simple. Check this out, guys. So I just went out to get the mail, and it's my birthday. And there's only one letter in the mail that looks like it might be from someone who may be sending a birthday card because it's like handwritten and everything. But no, check out what it is. Burial Essentials. Really? <laughs> I'm only 31, people. Yeah, Come on. Yeah, no. I'm not about to die. 
Jeez. <coughs> Throw that trash away. Good grief. Then my dad, he came over here and he pulled a mean joke on me. He was like, hey Robert, come out to the car, I got something for you. Well, I thought, okay, he's got a birthday present for me. No. He wants me to help him dump the leaves out of the back of his truck into a pit I have over here where should they come and pick up. And then he did have something for me, where'd it go? Oh, he gave me this. Water Pepsi. Awesome. It's Crystal Pepsi. Crystal Pepsi. So they like came out with it like in the nineties. It's got some crystal meth in it or something? No, what? It's crystal it's crystal clear. Water Pepsi. <laughs> so okay, we're going to review Water Pepsi for the first time on this vlog. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Here you go. Hopefully it's not as bad as this junk over here. That is absolutely terrible. Don't let any YouTuber tell you it's not. It's terrible. Ooh, water Pepsi fizzes up. That's confusing. <laughs> That's really confusing. Why? It tastes just like Pepsi. Does it? That's really weird. Is it like, it's clear all the way through. Yeah. That's really weird. <laughs> If Pepsi could be clear the whole time, why wouldn't they just always make it clear? Here you go, you try. I guess because that's weird because people were so used to Coke. I always do that when I drink soda. It's not because it tastes weird. No, it tastes like Pepsi. It tastes like Pepsi, right? So, are there any differences? I like don't drink soda, so that's why I made that face because it really, like, all that fizz on my tongue, it. Oh. I don't drink soda. That's really weird, guys. It tastes just like Pepsi. Give me a smile for a thumbnail. Awesome. So we just got out of Michael's. And who else, when they go to Michael's, always has to get a piece of chocolate? I do. Actually, Robert got it for me. I got it for you. He remembered. I sometimes forget, but pretty much every time I go, I get a little chocolate. But we just left Michael's. We had to get, this is my third day in a row. Third. I said this is my third day. <laughs> This is my third day. <laughs> this is my third day going to Michael's. Um, because you always just think of something else. You're like, oh man, I could really use that. But we wanted to give you a quick update on foster care. Because I'm sure a lot of you are like, um, weren't you supposed to have a baby like a month ago? We ran into some hiccups. They're getting worked out. And that's all we know. <laughs> So hopefully it'll be sometime soon that our license, hopefully this week, because we sent in all the paperwork and then they asked a bunch of questions and we had to do more paperwork. And so hopefully that was all. So hopefully that's done and we won't have to do any more paperwork. And then we'll be done. So exciting. So that's fun. Uh-huh, okay. All right, thanks, bye. Mondays are terrible days to have off, and that's my scheduled days off, and I never actually get to take it off. So right now, I'm gonna turn off my cell phone, and I'm gonna go outside, and I'm gonna cut the grass, and I'm gonna do it nice and slow, so that I actually have some time to myself. Hopefully my present will be here really soon. Kaylin said I can't open it, though, until she gets back home from work. <sighs> All right, the uh, yard is done. Front yard's done. Um, oh, I'm tired. And now it is lunchtime. So we have a ham and cheese and a turkey and cheese sandwich. And I am finishing this um, crystal clear Pepsi. I gotta tell you guys, it's actually really good. It tastes exactly like Pepsi, but it doesn't taste like it has nearly like the corn syrupy flavor that Pepsi has. You guys let me know what you think about it if you ever try it. Um, Robert's present came in the mail so he's gonna open it. Open it! I gotta think what it is first. No, hurry mm -hmm. up! We don't have room on the SD card. No, I think I know what it is. No, I don't know what it is now. <laughs> Are you really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh my gosh, you actually surprised me. What'd you think it was? I thought it was a GoPro. No. 
Oh my goodness, that is so cool. That's so cool. Do you like that? I like it's not it a so GoPro, much. but. No, but look, so before we tell them what it was, I was like shaking the box. I'm like, okay, it's heavier on the top than it is on the bottom, like GoPros are. And I was like, okay, it takes up the whole box. It's about the length of it. And I've been talking about GoPros forever. But this is super cool. Oh. You want to see what it is, guys? Yay. Yay. Is that not cool or what? Because you've been wanting one. I have been wanting one. I think they're the coolest little thing. And I got you a lot of film. How many films is that? 20, 20 photos. Yeah. That is so cool. I was not expecting that. I was like, I'm 100% sure it's a GoPro. Well, that's a disappointment. Why? The GoPro is a lot better than that. No, it's not. I like this. This is cool. I don't. Now, wanna... do you want to know where we're going to dinner? Yep, right there. Okay. Um, you're not supposed to do that with Polaroid. Oh, am, am I not? Really? No. Yeah, you're not. I thought you were supposed to. I know. Like everyone does that, right? I know. Anyway, we met some really cool people um, beside us, right? Mm -hmm. And it was her birthday too. Yeah. And when we sat down, it was someone else's birthday beside us. I knew she looked familiar the whole time. I was yeah. thinking maybe I saw, maybe she like came into the restaurant a lot like at Southern Press, but. Well, she works at the Y yeah. and we've taken classes from her before. And then her daughter knew how to work the camera, so she took the first photo. Yay! Look how cute. And now we need to write on it. Yeah, I need to write Robert's on it. Robert's birthday. Robert's 25th birthday. <laughs> okay, I'm 31, all right? So we're home. <sighs> Guys, this was so funny. I went to McDonald's to get a McFlurry, and I was watching the Hickman vlogs. And when I pulled up to the window to, or the drive through to start speaking, I turned the volume down in my radio, <laughs> trying to turn the volume of the Hickman vlogs down on my phone. And I was like, why is my radio not working? <laughs> I'm like sitting here twisting and twisting and he's like, can I help you? Twisting, twisting, can I help you? I'm like, yes a minute. And I look down and I see it playing on my phone. I was like, oh, that's why, yeah. Anyway, have you guys ever done that before? Yes, I have. I do it to the I've point done, where... I've done where I'll, um, like, I can't figure out if it's the air conditioning that I need to turn down or the radio. Have you ever done that? Yeah. You're that, driving and you're that. like, oh, I'm going to turn down the, the radio. And you do and you're like, no, wait, that's not what I needed. I needed to do. Yeah. That. Anyway, I got a call on the way home. And guess who it was? Who? My auntie aunt. And guess what she wanted to know? What? She wanted to know how much I charge for wedding videos. Oh, cool. Yeah. Um, a friend of her son's, which is a big family friend of theirs, mm -hmm. is getting married next month. They saw the wedding video and they're like, oh, that would be really cool if Robert did that. Mm -hmm. And Karen overheard him say it and she's like, well, that'll be my gift to you if you want to do that. Mm -hmm. So... She asked me how much I charge, and I'm like, I don't know. But guess what it is? What? The exact same day as that swing dance event. Oh no. Yeah, there's a swing dance event that is thinking about hiring me out to do a video for their event. Mm hmm And it's that day. Dang. I know. Do you have good news? It's your birthday. It's my birthday! <laughs> Point it on you. It's been pointing on me long enough. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like the video if you liked it. Um, actually, give it a thumbs up because it's Robert's birthday. Yay! And leave a comment below. Tell him a happy birthday. And subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Adios! Pray that I'm about to
you.